Well, audience, it's been a while since we did these, but we are back better than ever. I don't know why am I in these videos of playing horror games. Please shut the fuck up, Derek Carr. If I hear one more thing about a bunny rabbit, I will come to New Orleans and shove my foot right up your ass. You two need to learn some manners. I was told by Chicago Sports Talk, Michael, to put you guys in check for this series. Who let this old man pedophile in this call? Seriously, this dude is older than my step-grandpa. RJ, listen, anger leads to the dark side. You have anger problems. I have one thing to satisfy your anger, a capybara. The only thing that will satisfy me is you dying, you old balded fuck. Well, for this, folks, we're going to have to check on the animatronics, give them an electrical shock to wake them up. Is there an electric chair so we can put Derek Carr bitch ass in it? I'm already sick of him. His existence is creeping me out. Very funny, RJ. I see your videos of you saying that you are an internet tough guy that's a keyboard warrior. Out of all my existence in my life, I've never seen a kid's place like this before. Reminds me a lot of Chuck E. Cheese's back in the day. And you probably still go around to Chuck E. Cheese's. I'm assuming you pedophile. You like Joe Biden and sniffing children's hair. RJ, I may be many things. I may be an old fuck according to you, but don't compare me to that. Worst President Joe Biden ever again. Let's try another control. Damn, how many electrical shocks does this bitch need? Circus Baby is going to be a problem in this game. She is literally the main antagonist of the video game. She was once a person that killed a girl. If this place is a horror place, why does our character keep coming back here like seriously? Does he have a death wish? That's the fucking purpose of a horror type of film or game, you old cripple fuck. Huh. I guess Ballora has better things to do. Let's zap her. That should be fun. Why the fuck is it not working? I'm pressing it. I guess the horror game is in full effect. Circus Baby must be controlling these animatronics. Sync system restart. Holy shit, who turned off the lights? The power must have gone out because this place is old and looks abandoned. Entryway bend. Better keep the door closed at all times if we have any chance of surviving. Holy shit, what was that? That is a child's eye. It's scary than Bonnie the Bunny. Hold the door shut. I don't have much strength in me anymore. Of course you don't, because you're a washed up old man. I bet this old washed up man can kick your ass, RJ. You can't even hurt me even if you tried, bitch do it, pussy. Both of you shut the fuck up and play the game before I kick both of your asses. Let's try to get to the electric room in one piece to reset the power to this entire place. Holy shit, that's a little bunny. I'm scared right now. It's a goddamn puppet, you stupid cunt. Great job. Well, that includes night two. We just have to proceed calmly in the gallery. Well, great job, gamers. You guys did an amazing job. Well, we almost got killed by RJ because you talk too much shit about me. You know the monsters can hear you, RJ, and they will kill the rest of us. Oh, please, just shut the fuck up, your pussy, if we all die good, because the last thing the world needs to see is your stupid dumbass playing football on the team? Honestly, why does Roger Goodell seriously allow you to be on a team? I do not know. RJ, RJ, you absolutely have something stupid to say all the time about players. You absolutely get zero bitches with that afro on top of your head. Can you both shut the fuck up? You, will need to you are upsetting the, the children that are watching this episode. I don't know how we get this done with you guys arguing like a bunch of fuckboys, but we do a very good job. I think that I should take the lead in this. Derek Carr, you fucking dumbass, you got us killed. Great job, Derek Carr, you got us kidnapped, you fucking idiot. We were so close to getting home, but you fucked it up for everyone just like you always do. Two hours later. Fucking hurry this shit up, we have been at this shit for two fucking hours. Oh, thank God we are done with this night. This is the most hardest game mode I have ever played in my existence. I have to agree with Patrick. That level was completely hard, and it takes skill to complete it. I still don't know why our character keeps coming back to the shit place. Oh, look, it's Derek Carr's girlfriend, a fucking clown. I'm already sick and tired of your shit, RJ, you fucking nigger. Did you seriously just call him the N-word with the hard ER? You are lucky you didn't say that to my face otherwise. I'd drop you in the ground. Seriously, what the fuck, Derek? You didn't need to say that now the Saints are going to know about it. Wait, I didn't mean to say that. Please don't send it to the Saints. My career is going to end for sure. Too late. I'm already recording it, and I'm sending it to the Saints GM right now. I don't care if your career is ending. You just did the NFL fan base a favor anyways. Careful not to... Cleaning and 
repair of the scooper. Car, you got us kidnapped. Now you're getting us killed now. Great fucking job. But at least the NFL don't have to waste their Sunday watching you play anyways. Well, I lived a good life anyways, but it's sad it had to end with you dumb fucks. Well, folks, this is Patrick Stewart talking to you in the spirit life. Please get this video to 10 likes to see the alternative ending to this Five Nights at Freddy's Sister's location if you want to save the cast. Oh, and if you're asking me how am I alive, I played Charles Xavier in X-Men, and I have the gift of returning into another conscious body. <laughs>